Let's read this question. In figure 1a below, a single phase, two winding power transformer is rated for 30 kV, 200 kV, 1000 kV A60 Hz. Neglect the short circuit impedance, the core equivalent resistance, and XM. The two windings of the transformer are connected like this. In short, they are connected in series. This terminal is connected to this terminal H1. And then we go ahead and apply a voltage VA of 207 kilovolts. The first question is, what is this voltage VB? And secondly, what is the maximum possible power that we can feed here and the load? This is the question to explore two basic concepts. First, that two coils linked by the same magnetic field have voltages that are related to one another according to their number of turns, regardless of the way we connect them externally. So that is that V1 is 2V2 as 30 is to 200, regardless that they are connected like this or separately. And secondly, to explore the understanding of the concept of ratings. For each one of the coils, we have two different ratings. The maximum safe voltage for each coil, 30 kilovolts for this one, 200 kilovolts for the secondary, and the maximum safe current for each coil, which is 1000 kVA divided by 30 kilovolts for this one, that is 33.3 amps, that is the safe maximum current for this coil. 1000 kVA divided by 200 kilovolts, that is 5 amps, that is the maximum safe current for this one. So the safe maximum current or rated current of the primary is 33.3 amps. And the safe maximum current for the secondary is 1000 kVA divided by 200 kilovolts, which is 5 amps. When I feed 33.3 amps into the dot in the primary, I have 5 amps coming out of the dot on the secondary like that. That is a safe current on this side. When I go ahead and connect those two coils like this, those basic conditions remain the same. In this case, I have no saying on the voltage. The voltage VA is given to us. That is 207 kilovolts. In short, V1 plus V2 is 207 kilovolts. But we also know that V1 is with V2 as 30 is with 200. We have two equations and two unknowns. These two equations, we solve for V1 and we solve for V2. The voltages are 27 and 180 volts. V2 is the voltage we're looking for. V2 is 180 volts, which is VB, one of the voltages we're looking for. But now that the voltage is known and is given to us, it's fixed. The maximum load here implies maximum current here. Well, let's talk about maximum currents. You and I know that the maximum safe current we can feed into this coil is how much? 33.3 amps. That is correct. But when we do that, out of this dot, we will have 5 amps pumping out, like so. 5 amps. That is the maximum current condition in this transformer. But when we do that, the current in the load is going to be according to a KCL equation in this node, 38.3 amps. What is the power in this case? 180 volts, which is VB, bingo, times 38.3 amps. In short, is that power in the load will be 180 kilovolts. This should be kilovolts, right? That multiplies 38.3 amps. 6,900 kVA. And you must be thinking, how is it possible that I can feed almost 7,000 kVAs with a transformer whose ratings are only good for 1,000 kVA? Well, that teaches you never to close your mind. Just by a simple connection, the engineer has found ways of feeding higher loads with a simple, cheaper equipment. This connection is used in industry very often. Thank you. 
very much.